Um, last night, the Commission completed a hat-trick of agreements on delivering the European Green Deal, with the third successful trilogue with Parliament and Council on our Fit for 55 proposals. So last night, we reached a provisional agreement on the regulation on land use, land use change and forestry, known in climate jargon as LULUCF. The new regulation will reverse the declining trend in the EU's natural carbon sinks, and it sets a target for net carbon removals of 310 million tonnes of CO2 equivalent by 2030. Each member state will contribute a fair share, and with the target distributed among them based on recent levels of removals or emissions, and the potential to further increase these removals. Member states have many measures at hand to improve their carbon sinks, including sustainable forest management or the rewetting of peatlands. EU funds like the LIFE programme and the Common Agricultural Policy can offer financial support to member states. So as I said, this is a hat-trick for us. Last night's success follows on from Tuesday night's agreement on the effort sharing regulation and the deal we reached two weeks ago on 27th of October to end the sale of new CO2 emitting cars by 2035. With the COP27 negotiations ongoing and against the backdrop of Russia's aggression in Ukraine, it's very important that Europe is not losing focus and is not backtracking on the European Green Deal. We are moving forward with the green transition, we are delivering on our promises and we are turning ambition into action. Thank you. Thank you very much, Tim.